This video is gonna be slightly different than what you usually see on this channel because we usually talk about how if you quickly make money online and how if you just make money online as fast as possible. But inside of this video, I will show you how to actually establish a long-term online business without actually building your own website, without investing a single dollar and with no social media followers. So you don't need Instagram, you don't need YouTube subscribers or anything like that. And I will walk you through the entire process step by step, but you have to stick with me all the way until the end of the video and watch every single second because if you don't you will probably get confused and lost and this will not work for you so if you actually want to establish a long-term online business over the next 10 minutes then make sure to pay close attention to every second of this video just a quick disclaimer here if someone replies to your comment like this claiming they're me just know it's a scam i don't have whatsapp i don't have telegram and i would never text you for money you can check their accounts they don't have a verification badge they don't have the same subscribers or videos as me and they will just scam you my only instagram account is at i'm dave nick people are just creating fake accounts, reposting my photos and DMing you asking for money. You can check their posts, the engagement is fake, there are new accounts and just know that I would never text you like that. So just stay safe and report them all. So with all of that being said, let's go through the first step, which is to go over to Kitco. This is already kit.co. And this is a platform where you will be able to build your own store with products that you don't actually own, that you don't actually have in your your, your apartment, your house, it doesn't matter. You, you don't own any of those products and it's not drop shipping. I'm going to show you what this is all about. But for the step number one, you also want to choose a niche because you want to focus on one specific niche and just go all in on that one. You don't want to be focusing on fitness and then focusing on gaming and then business and crypto. And then suddenly you hear NFTs are a thing and then you start with NFTs. Like you want to focus on one specific niche. If you're, let's say, into fitness, then go with fitness. If you're into camping, then go with camping. If you're into fishing, that's a great one. You can go with fishing. For this particular example, I'm going to go with fitness because it's extremely easy and simple to explain it with this niche. But as I said, you can go with literally anything that you're passionate about. Maybe that's basketball, maybe that's football, maybe that's hockey, whatever it is. So what you want to do is you want to sign up to Kitco for the step number two. Click on the sign up button over here and create an account either with Twitter, Facebook or email. And then you can just sign into your account. I'm going to continue with Facebook because it's the easiest option. Now, once you create an account on Kitco, what you simply want to do is you want to start your own store. And the way you start your own store is like these different people that are doing that. Like, for example, this person has a PC gaming store. If you open up his store, it has six different products and we can browse like, all right, if I'm into PCs and gaming, then I will come to here and I will buy everything I need for my gaming setup. If I'm into like, you can find top creators here. If I'm into, let's say, uh, technology, then I can open up this store over here. I can see what this guy has for his setup. And as you can see, we will have all of these different products that we can instantly buy. I can buy this in Amazon. I can buy this on Amazon as well. I can buy this in different stores. So if I want to have the same setup as this guy, I will come over to here and I will buy all of the products from his store. So what you can simply do is you can start your own store by pressing on the plus button and you can click on create a new kit and then you can enter the kit name. In this case, I'm going to enter like fitness God. Like let's say for example, that's going to be my store name. And this is all about fitness. You will write a description about what your store is all about and then click on next. And then as I said, you don't necessarily need your own products because what you can do is you can just search for the products here. And then when someone buys those products from your store, you're just gonna earn a commission. So basically you don't actually have to ship the products or whatever, you just create a store and that's it. When someone buys, you just get paid. And then the, the vendor actually, you know, creates the product, ships the product, does customer support, all of that. All you gotta do is just drive traffic to your store and I'm gonna show you exactly how. So you can just type in here, let's say if I wanna have a fitness store, if I'm gonna have, like a gym related equipment. I will type in like dumbbell here. I don't know how to spell dumbbell, but I think it's like this or something like that. Uh, dumbbell, uh, yeah, I did that correctly. So I'm gonna add this product here. I will add this to my kit. Then I will think about what else do people need when they wanna create their own gym or when they wanna do fitness. Uh, let's say, for example, I'm going to search for a fitness related products. So I'm going to add this mattress here. This is for yoga. I'm going to add something else. I'm going to also type in fitness here. Let's say, for example, I want to add this one. This is a really cool product that I can also sell. Whatever is related to fitness, whatever is related to gym and stuff like that, I will just search for it and I will try to find some products. If I want to add this, I can easily do that. And then once I have these products into my store, I recommend you add at least 10 different products because the more the products that you have, the higher chances are that you're going to make more money because there's 
more available over there. But also you don't want to add too many products because then people are going to get confused. They're going to think like, well, do I need this or this or this? And they're not going to end up buying anything. But if you have like 10 different products that are all related to each other, they're going to think like, all right, I probably need all of this stuff for my camping equipment or I'll need all this stuff for fishing or for gaming. And so they're going to buy all of those products and you're going to maximize your results. So somewhere around 10 products would be perfect. Now, once you have them, you can click on view kit and you will share it later on. So just click on share later. This is my own store that they have over here. It says fitness gods. You can, of course, customize it for your own needs. And then when someone comes in and they can see these products, they can buy the, the, this watch. They can just click here to buy it on Amazon. They can buy this. They can buy this. So now what I got to do is I got to share this kit with other people. So there's going to be a button where you can copy the link for this particular store that you just made. So now that you have a store that's related to one specific niche and when someone comes in, just remember you're going to be making money when someone buys these products, you're going to earn a commission on this platform. What I want to do next is you want to open up Instagram and you want to search for a Instagram page in that particular niche that gives tips, tips about fishing, tips about camping, tips about gaming, tips about fitness in this case, business, crypto, finance, whatever that might be. In this case, I search for fitness tips and I just found this small page that posts valuable content about fitness and then what I can simply do is I can just go through their posts and see what is actually performing well what people are mostly interested in like posts like these that are kind of valuable I can basically copy them so I can just open up this and I can see like all right they gave some useful data about peanuts and and, and uh, almonds well, now what I can do is I can just open up canva.com, which is a tool that will allow you to edit different images for completely free. So it's a design tool. And then you can just click on create a new design. And you want to start with a Pinterest pin design that's going to give you this template here. And what it will do is in this case, I will search, I will go to the photos section on the left side. I will search for almonds and then I will add these boys uh, here on the left side. So I'm basically recreating the post that I found on Instagram. And then I will also search for peanuts. And I'm perhaps going to use these boys on the right side. And here we have them. So we have peanuts and almonds left and right. Now I'm also going to add the useful data, which is like how many grams of protein they have and stuff like that. So on the left side, I'm going to type in whatever these guys say protein two grams carbs two grams fats five grams all right protein carbs and fats and then you can customize the text in this case i will just add something on the background i can customize the font as well if i don't like this one i can just go with for example this font over here it looks a little bit better and then i will just paste it here i will copy paste this and then i will type in whatever it was about um, the peanuts it was protein 2.6 grams carbs 1.6 all right I will, I will try to remember that so protein 2.6 and then we also have 1.6 grams carbs and also 4.9 grams of fat comparing these two. All right. Now, once I have the design that I've copied from one of those Instagram pages, like obviously you're not just stealing their content. You're not just downloading their content and reposting onto other platforms because that's not necessarily legal. But if you recreate them or you add your own value, you can actually go with that. So this is like a, a brand new, brand new design that I just made myself. So it's unique and I can click on share and I can download it to my computer by pressing on the download button. Now, the next thing that you got to do with these designs. So once you know that you can create them in literally less than three minutes, you can create as many of these different designs and then you can start a store on Pinterest. You can create your own account on Pinterest, your profile on Pinterest. That's going to be all about, in this case, fitness or whatever that might be for you. That might be fishing for you. That might be gaming for you. That might be camping. And then you just click on create a pin here and then you will start a new board. Uh, I'm going to create a new board, which is in this case going to be fitness gods where I'm going to be posting all about fitness. I'm going to be giving fitness advice and I'm going to drag this here and I'm going to type in uh, almonds versus peanuts. And this is going to attract people that are actually interested in this. And then we'll maybe write a brief description and tell people that if they need equipment related to fitness, if they want to check out my fitness store, they can click on the destination link and that destination link is going to be this link here. So you just want to go back to your store and then you want to copy the link address again. So copy the link to share for your Kitco store and then you can paste that here and then you can share it on your on your board that's related to that specific niche and if you do this regularly you're going to start building an audience on pinterest that is related to that specific topic so it's obviously going to be easier to get people to click on your store go to your store purchase some products and make you money like that and that's how you can establish a 500 dollars a day affiliate marketing business without actually building your own website without actually posting any youtube videos and without investing a single dollar so i really hope you got some value out of this video if you did make sure to drop a like down below and i will see you in some of the next ones